my upper abdomen ached, when I found out why, I ran to the doctor at once. In brief moments a written explanation. Generally, we think that the pain is directly related to the area that suffers it. For example, if our wrist hurts, we think we have hurt her. If our head hurts, we think that we take a lot of sun or have a migraine, and so on. However, sometimes, the area where we feel the pain is not precisely the affected area. Rather, these pains indicate problems that are elsewhere more difficult to diagnose. On many occasions, it is best to determine what these pains mean. This way we can act quickly and avoid major complications. In this we let you know some pains and what can be a symptom. 1. Pain in the chest. Sometimes, if your chest hurts, it's because something is wrong with your lungs. Since the lungs do not have enough nerve endings, we cannot feel the pain in them. Therefore, the discomfort manifests itself in the form of pain in the chest. Other common symptoms are coughing and difficulty breathing freely. 2. Middle area of the abdomen. If the middle area of the abdomen bothers you, just above the ribs, possibly it is a gastric problem. It could also be a problem in the esophagus or even gastritis. This pain can occur in the same way at the same height in the back. If just before eating the pain increases, but calms down after eating, it may indicate the presence of an ulcer. 3. Pain left side of the chest. If the left side of the chest hurts and it extends to the arms, shoulder blades and neck, it can be heart problems. In case you feel chest pressure, it could be an impending heart attack. In this case, immediately call for emergencies. Symptoms can vary in men and women, so it is better to see the doctor as soon as possible. 4. Pain in the navel area. If this area of the body hurts, it may be a problem in the small intestine. If the pain is accompanied by nausea, fever and loss of appetite, it can be an appendicitis in the large intestine. 5. Pain in the right side of the abdomen. If that is the pain that you are suffering, most likely you have some problem in the large intestine. If this is accompanied by constipation, it is a clear signal that this is exactly the problem, the large intestine. 6. Upper abdominal area. In this case, most likely you have problems in the pancreas. Other symptoms may include fever, nausea, headache, tachycardia and weight loss. 7. Back pain. If what hurts is your back, suspect your kidneys. It is often confused with a simple muscular pain. However, if it is the kidneys, the difference will be evident in that the pain will become more acute below the ribs, sometimes reaching the legs. 8. Pain in the upper right area of the abdomen, in this case, worry about your gallbladder and liver. This pain can also appear in the same place on the back and be very constant. It is not very frequent, but it could be accompanied by nausea, vomiting and yellowish skin. These can be symptoms of gallbladder cancer in the worst case. If you have any suspicion, go to your doctor as soon as possible. 9. Lower left abdomen, this pain may indicate problems in the appendix. Normally this pain can spread throughout the stomach. It may also move to the right thigh and the pain will increase when walking or coughing. If you also have tremors, chills, diarrhea and fever, it is probably an appendicitis. See your doctor as soon as possible. As you see, pain is often not related to the area in which it appears. Therefore, you must be very attentive to these, so that you avoid worse complications. That way, you'll know what to do and how to act as soon as they show up. If you like the video and you think it can help you, I invite you to give it a like, share the video with your friends and subscribe to my channel, so you don't miss any videos. Here you have other videos that may interest you.